when you die, who gets what and when and how much? These are questions you should answer now to save your family a lot of heartache and save everyone a lot of money later. To get us started, Mike Niederhelman is here to educate us on estate planning. Mark is a financial advisor with the Lineweaver Financial Group. Welcome to the show. Thank you, Lori. So we all know we should have a will, but why? Well, a will is a personal declaration of your intentions about the disposition of your assets when you pass away. And you're right, everybody should have one. The fact is, most people don't have a will. A 2007 Harris Interactive study found that 55% of adult Americans do not have a will. Yet 95% of those same people want to decide who their money goes to, something that's probably not going to happen if they don't have a will. Wow, Without a will, transfer of your assets could be complicated, expensive, and create unnecessary taxes. So can we just write up a will on our own? Um, estate planning is very complicated and it causes the creation of legal documents like trusts and wills. These are critical tasks and I think it's necessary for you to consult a knowledgeable person like an estate, uh, an estate and a trust attorney. Because they can, you can make mistakes if you try to do it on your own, huh? You can, you can. And when you're getting started, the, the basic things that you want to address are how much can you give, who do you give it to, and when do you give it to them? You might want to give assets to people during your lifetime, or you might want those assets distributed to them after your death. And these three issues are interactive. Changing one of these could complicate the estate planning process. Sure. So you want to do, do a good job. Okay, Doke, so um, let's say we did our, our will a few years ago. So are we all good to go and nothing else we have to worry about? Could be, but it probably is a good idea just to review a couple of things to make sure that everything is in order. For example, do the parties involved in your will know that they're involved so have you had a conversation with your executor letting them know that they're the executor? <laughs> Having this conversation might bring up some competency issues and it's a good idea to find out if there's any competency problems yeah. before, before it's too late. Before something is too late, Exactly. Yeah. I think it's also important to review your will in, in light of life's changes. There are births, there are deaths, there are divorces. Does your will still accomplish what it is that you wanted it to accomplish? I like, up, I like backup plans. Do your estate planning documents have backup plans? What if one of your children predeceases you? Are assets going to go to your grandchildren or are those grandchildren gonna be bypassed? Are there successors to those appointed in your will? Is there a successor executor? Your estate planning documents need to be able to stand the test of time. You need to make sure that there's adequate liquidity. In today's depressed real estate market, your executor might need to put money into your home to get it to the point where it can be sold. The last thing you want to do is create a fire sale. The last thing is, are those that are going to inherit money capable of handling the inheritance? Too many horror stories have come from someone either too young or otherwise incapable of handling money and the gift turned out to be a curse. Yeah, there's so many issues you've got to deal with, but you've got help, right? A seminar coming up. We do, as a matter of fact. Line Weaver Financial Group is having one of our educational programs on June 9th and June 11th, and this seminar is entitled, Don't Leave Your Family with a Flawed Estate Plan. If you're interested in attending, give our office a call. Sounds great. As no one likes to think about, let alone plan for their death but making arrangements could be the most loving gift you could ever give to your family, freeing them from unnecessary stress and costs. To learn more, attend the Live Weaver Financial Group seminar or give them a call. The number's coming up next. For more information, call the Line Weaver Financial Group at 1-888-313-4009 or click to www.lineweaver.net.